crowds flocked outside Aung San Suu Kyi's party headquarters in Myanmar's capital. So thick she faced a challenge getting through to make her address and filming inside the jostling was tough. Her supporters were jubilant over the election win she's now claimed, looking set to take public office for the first time. Her opposition party believes it's won at least 43 of 44 parliament seats it contested in Sunday's by-election, even if official results are slow to trickle in and irregularities are contested. It is not so much our triumph as the triumph of the people who have decided that they must be involved in the political process of this country. The balloting appears to mark a major milestone in Myanmar. We hope that this will be the beginning of a new era where there will be more emphasis on the role of the people in the everyday politics of our country. The election after nearly two decades of house arrest for Suu Kyi and tight military rule for the country not only generated excitement inside Myanmar, but picked up measured support from the international community. U.S. Secretary of State Clinton. The United States congratulates the people who participated, many for the first time, in the campaign and election process. We are committed to supporting these reform efforts. Clinton said even the most closed societies can open, even if one human rights expert was warning the hard work to achieve reform in Myanmar starts now. Karen Sloan, The Associated Press.